Hello everybody, welcome to one of my Disney News updates. I don't know if you can tell or not, but um, I have my regular camera back. Bloggy, I named him Bloggy, yes I know. Um, I have him back now, so that's good. He's all fixed and ready to make videos. What? Okay. Um, last week's Disney News update was a pretty long one and lengthy one and it had lots of stuff on it because the D23 Expo was last weekend. And this week, um, or not last weekend, but two weekends ago. Uh, this week um, doesn't have much stuff, so it's gonna be a little different than last week's Disney News update. Um, but I'm just gonna jump right into it. Already, I know, it's August, and uh, already Christmas stuff is being announced. Uh, these are Christmas offerings announced for to the Tokyo at Disney Resort, um, which is the celebration for Christmas will be running through November 9th through December 25th. Tokyo Disneyland Park will be celebrating a Christmas fantasy, and this year it's going to be themed after uh, Christmas storybooks. So throughout the park, they're going to set up little Christmas scenes starring uh, favorite Disney characters. There's going to be a daytime parade called Disney Christmas Stories. There's also going to be pop-up storybooks and other decor around the park depicting Disney characters enjoying the holidays. In Tokyo Disney Sea Park, they are celebrating Christmas wishes with a new entertainment offering called A Perfect Christmas, which will feature Disney characters sharing their dreams of Christmas. There's also going to be a nighttime show called Colors of Christmas. Um, it's returning this year, uh, and it has a fantastic shining Christmas tree floats um, on the harbor waters. If you guys don't know, Disney Sea Park um, is what it sounds like. It features uh, it's like it has a big harbor lagoon thing in the middle, like the sea, and then around it each land depicts different like coastal areas of the world kind of and or Disney movies. Um, it's pretty it's a pretty cool looking park. And now bringing it closer to home, Disneyland Resort is has announced um, some details for the Halloween season. So if you are visiting Disneyland Resort uh, this Halloween season, these are details that you would like to know. Um, on Mickey's Halloween party nights that require separate admission tickets, on top of the regular admission to the park, Paint the Night will still be going on as the uh, parade, and uh, Halloween Screams for the fireworks show. On non-party nights, the uh, regular Disneyland 60th birthday um, entertainment will continue, which is Pain the Night and Disneyland Forever Fireworks. That's actually all I have for this week's Disney News Update, and now it's a short one. Um, short and sweet. But um, yeah, stay tuned for next Tuesday for another Disney News Update. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button, because I would greatly appreciate that. Also give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and feel free to comment below, because if you want to talk to me, I'll talk to you. Um, until next time, stay safe, healthy, and happy, and I'll see you later.